Welcome to the second lesson of the lecture 2 budgetary control overview With the product overview and budgetary control and encumbrance accounting is a fully integrated product The minimum subscription required to use a budgetary control and encumbrance accounting features is financial and procurement plus expenses if you want to implement budgetary control on spend authorizations so you can see here various modules here so financials we have budgetary control and payables so payables where you can fund the check your invoices and we have some ledger accounting general ledger which are the modules that are going to create accounting for you with procurement we have a purchasing and self-service procurement so we can fund the check our requisitions and our purchase orders and then depending on your business requirements you may have PPM as a project portfolio management cloud where you can fund the check transactions that have project attributes associated with them if you have more advanced budget planning needs you can consider EBM as enterprise performance management to planning and budgeting cloud and then we also integrate with supply chain modules for costing and receiving transactions and just to mention third party financials procurement PPM and supply chain modules are not supported with our budgetary control and the encumbrance accounting as I mentioned the budgetary control and the encumbrance accounting these are two independent features budgetary control refers to a group of system options and processes that are used to determine which transactions are subject to validation against budget and the budget consumption to prevent overspending which encumbrance accounting performs accounting that creates journal entries for requisitions and purchase orders that will become expenditure when goods and service are invoiced and entered it records estimated costs before the actual expenditure to allow managers to plan for the future impact of previous financial decisions they are independent processes budgetary control and encumbrance accounting independent processes that are managed by budgetary control sub ledger accounting and general ledger our budgetary control process provides that additional validation on transactions projects and journal entries to, to determine whether spending is allowed and by transaction I mean your requisitions both internal and external purchase orders and the change orders spend authorizations if you are using expenses and you want to have budgetary control on those receiving transactions payable invoices for projects we have projects and the grant expenditure costs and the burdening and for our journal entries we have our sub ledger accounting and the manual entries or manual journal entries our GL manual journal entries the encumbrance accounting process creates the encumbrance journal entries for the requisitions and the POs and use manual journals in general ledger or sub ledger accounting for third party as a commitment and obligation Budgetary control and encumbrance accounting is a complete, insightful, and flexible. So complete because you can prevent overspending with real-time budgetary control and provide accounting for your procure-to-pay transactions. Insightful because we can proactively monitor your budget consumption with our with post reporting. We have got various reporting options. We can use Smart View, FRS as a financial reporting web studio, OTBI. For example, we have some BI publisher reports 
plus we have our budget monitor where you can set up what we call an account group or a budget account group where you can monitor your funds available so you can see your commitments obligations expenditure and funds available flexible because you can control your spending at a detail level if you wish or at a summary account level so at a parent level if you wish so do you want to budget and have a budget at the detail level or do you want to check your funds for maybe total expenses rather than each individual expenses account so you have choices as to how you want to control your spending and validated or validations of the transactions against multiple set of budget budgetary controls policies you can have a number of control budgets set up and the, your transactions if applicable will be validated against each of those budgets and just to mention budgetary control and income risk accounting features are most commonly implemented by public sector organizations to ensure that the expenditure is fightly controlled against budget to prevent any overspend. This is the end of our lecture 2 and see you in the next lecture.